Good evening, and welcome to Real Talk, where every Sunday night we offer insight, education, and resources to in-home child caregivers and those affecting their world. This is the children, the parents, and the extended family, along with everyone who loves them. And our goal is to offer real-life topics and learning through discussing real issues and offering real solutions. Tonight, I'm especially excited to welcome our guest, because this is somebody who's been very special to me for a long time, but is going to be taking on a new role. And so I'm very excited to really kind of introduce you to her in a different way. Um, so I want to welcome Julie Morgan. So good evening, Julie. Welcome. Hi, Tanya. Thank you so much for having me. I'm normally planning and coordinating and facilitating all of this. So it's a little different being on this side of the camera, but I'm so honored to be on and get to talk with you all tonight. Absolutely. And yeah, it is a little different when you're taking on a different role. But you probably are wondering why we have Julie on here tonight. So if you're a student of our company, you're probably familiar with Julie if you've ever emailed the office, especially in the last two years. She's been with us for a couple of years, part-time, as our student care representative, but Julie is coming on board full-time with Newborn Care Solutions now and taking over as our operations manager. So basically, she's going to handle a whole lot of everything, and we're going to talk about that tonight and what that's going to look like both for her, but also for you as one of our students or as an agency or even as a family that's interacting with our company and how she's going to serve you. Um, Julie has over three years experience in the nanny industry specifically. Um, you may also have recognized her name because she's been on staff with the International Nanny Association for a while. And she also works with agencies to assist with branding, supporting them in a lot of different ways. And she has, of course, been with us for about two years, supporting students and agencies. And so we're really excited for this new role that we get to work with her on. And we're going to kind of dig into that and give you some more insight about what you can expect from Julie in her new role. But before we get into that, Julie, can you tell us a little bit about kind of your journey, where, how you got to this place? And anything else you want to share with the audience so they can get to know you a little better? Absolutely. So I originally, um, I went to school at North Carolina State University and majored in communications, had the plan to be work at some big PR firm in Raleigh. Um, then I met my husband now, um, and he's in the military. And so being a military spouse, you move around all the time. And so my first job out of college, um, I, I was in sales. That just really wasn't fitting um, what I was looking for. And so I was like, okay, what can I do um, that I can still support my husband by traveling um, and moving all of the time um, and all of that? And so then, um, as most of you know, Megan Metzger, she um, let me know about this wonderful opportunity with the International Nanny Association. Um, so, and then from there, um, I graciously accepted the position. Um, from there, she introduced me to great agencies. And from that too, I met Tanya, which has been such a blessing in my life, um, which has led me to this role. And it's something that I truly am passionate about. I love getting to help so many people on so many different aspects, whether that's a student here at Newborn Care Solutions, I'm helping them with their courses and what to take, or if it's an agency, I'm helping them in the right direction too. So that's how I got to this point now. And it is so, such an honor to be here. Yeah, and we are we are glad to have you. And for those of you who know me in any capacity whatsoever, you also know that Julie doesn't just take care of the students and the agencies, but she takes pretty darn good care of me as well. <laughs> um, because I'm I'm much more focused on just wanting to show up and teach and support people, support families, support students in their learning and their growth, and really provide that empowerment. And certainly if it involves anything where tech is involved, <laughs> it's not me handling it. Um, and that has been an invaluable asset to us. Um, and we're excited to bring Julie on, on more full time with us because we have so many things here at Newborn Care Solutions that we want to bring to you as students and as families and as agencies that we just can't do. There's just not enough hours in the day. And this is going to allow us to do a lot more of that. So we're really excited about that. So 
I kind of want to dig in a little bit here so that people have a better understanding, Julie. So can you tell us a little bit more about what your role is going to encompass, what you're going to be doing? Absolutely. So like Tanya said, I will have my hands in a little bit of everything. So um, whether that be with student care, helping you um, through your journey, helping you find classes, all of that, um, and the trainings to do and what best fits you, I'm still going to be here for you. But the great thing about this is that instead of having the limited hours with part-time, I'll be more readily available for you, which is super exciting. Um, to have all that. And we also have a couple other projects um, up our sleeve that we're in the midst of working on that we'll be able to fully just dive into now that we have um, me in the office full time. Um, and Tanya has all my attention with that too. So we're super excited um, to provide these types of uh, trainings for you that are coming up. Um, working more closely with agencies, with our new um, agency consulting program that Tanya has. Um, I'm not sure if I'm missing something, Tanya. I know there's just so many things. I really will just have my hand in everything and facilitating everything and just to really see these um, visions and these plans that we have to bring the best um, training and care for our students to fruition. Yeah, absolutely. And it really, I think you really nailed it when you said we have a lot of things up our sleeve that we have been working on behind the scenes, but we can only work on them in little bits at a time. Because, of course, we have to deal with the day-to-day operations. Uh, and having more hours and more time will allow that. And it also does. Having you full-time provides a quicker response time for our agencies and our students who might need assistance with things. Um, so that's going to be really, really awesome in terms of really benefiting the students and the agencies and parents who reach out to us. Uh, media contacts that reach out to us. There's just so much more that we will have the ability to do. Uh, and if you guys haven't checked it out yet, you should go check out the new website as well. Julie has been incredibly instrumental in helping us get that going. And uh, she will be the one that you reach out to if you like, if you're one of our elite students and you want to get your stuff up there and listed on there. Julie will be the one that helps update that kind of stuff. Um, really pretty much anything that needs to be done is going to go that way. So if a student or an agency kind of reaches out and says, hey, I need some help with this, what can they expect? Will they get a phone call? Will they get an email? What's that look like for them? Absolutely. Um, so the best way to is just to send me an email or give me a call. Um, we actually are just, that's another project that we have. So we have a new phone number. So you will be able to reach us and reach me personally that way um, in the office so I can help you. So we can provide that service to you. I know with so many things, some people prefer email and some people really prefer that voice to voice contact. So it's whatever you prefer. We can talk through it. Um, some people email might be best. So I'm happy to do and meet whatever your needs are as far as that. So we can kind of talk through that, see what is the best fit for you that way. Um, so yeah, so any way you want to get in touch with me, I'm going to be here for you. Yeah, and we'll be providing both um, the office email and the office phone number in the, the feed so that you can take a look at that, check that out. Um, and can reach out that way. And I and I love that you brought that up, Julie, because we do hear from students a lot. You know, email is great, but I really want to talk to somebody. I really want to get a direct one-on-one -on -one answer. And sometimes, depending on what it is, that's they need to have a conversation with me. Uh, but that's usually more focused on, you know, uh, geez, is this the right class for me? And I need to kind of ferret out, what are your goals? What are your long-term things? Because newborn care solutions is a great avenue. For a lot of people, but it's not the right avenue for everyone. And sometimes, you know, that can be great. But if it's just an issue of, hey, I'm looking at the, the LMS and I'm, I, I don't know, do I take this one class that says PP after it? Or do I take this one? And why are they different priced and how do they work? Julie can give you all the answers around the nuts and bolts of how all this stuff works. Um, and I, I'd love to bring up an example of, of a problem we've had recently that you helped solve. So we had a student who reached out and said they were having a problem completing their test. Now, a test is not required to take our class, but if you want to apply for certification or you want to apply for continuing education through CAPA, 
that test is required and they were having a problem with it. And everybody was tagging me. Julie, am I the person who helped solve those problems? <laughs> no. <laughs> Tanya is brilliant in most things, but come to me with the tech stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if it's babies or students or medical stuff and the parents, yeah, I can go there, but tech <laughs> stuff is not my game. Um, so what else, what other things are should students expect that they're going to be maybe seeing your face and your name a little bit more? Absolutely. So just like we covered, just me being more present, me being here, readily available, new projects, all of that. So you'll see my face there. If you're um, an elite student or master student, you're already working with me and Tanya closely with that. So I will still be um, facilitating with that and helping with that. Um, still helping with real talks. And so, and like Tanya said too, with media context, this will give us the opportunity to provide you with better, um, more in-depth training. And whether that be here on real talks that I'll have the time to really do like some market research to see, okay, what will best be the fit for um, our audience here tonight. So even if you have ideas for that, please feel free to share them in the feed right now. Um, we would love to hear your ideas for that. Um, Yes, yeah, so I'm super excited um, to just be more present here at Newborn Care Solutions. And we have so much, again, planned um, to accomplish at, um, by the end of 2020. Um, and we've had this ongoing list. And so I'm so excited to really just dive in um, to see these plans just come to life and bring life to them and really um, to provide fruitful education for you all. Um, so if there's any way um, I can do to support you or um, your training needs, please let me know. That's what I'm here for. That's my job um, in any capacity um, that you think. Yeah, I agree. We've had that list since the end of 2020 that we've been right. working on. And now that we're into 2021, we, and at this point, we finally can move forward much more instead of just inching along with a lot of things. Yes. We really are going to have that ability. And I'm excited about what yes. this is going to bring for our students um, and for the agencies that we're working with. Yes. Uh, it just is a big, a big excitement for me. So I'm excited to have you come on board. I'm excited for what it means for all of our students. And I think it's going to be amazing. I agree. I'm so honored to be here. And thank you all um, to students, agencies, parents. Um, thank you all for just allowing this opportunity to happen, um, for trusting in this business and in Tanya's vision. I know it's easy to trust somebody like her because she is, of course, brilliant. And it is such an honor um, to be here, um, not only working for you um, students, agencies and parents, but just to work under Tanya. Um, she's incredible. And this is such an honor. Well, thanks, Julia. <laughs> um, I just think we're just a good fit. We work well together. I, we so. make a good team. <laughs> we do. So is there anything else that you want to share with our audience tonight before we wrap up? Of course. So just like I said, if there's anything that you... Um, would love to see from me, um, please feel free to share that in the feed. Um, I would love to have any questions that you have about my new role that we might not have covered on here. Or if there's, um, again, any um, topics for Real Talk or any other ways that you would really like to see happen in the office, please um, don't hesitate to share that in the feed. We love your feedback. Um, that's how we um, keep moving forward and come up with all these ideas. So please share that with us, um, how I can help you. Um, and I'm excited for what's in store for the next year. And to the years to come too. Yeah, I'm excited too. And you know what? You made a really great point that I would love for our audience to think about and take away. We do create everything that we create is created based on our student feedback. Uh, we really did. We started with just our foundational class, never really expecting that things would expand to the level that they have. Everything that we've created beyond that, even the foundational class, was based on a request from people who became students of our company that I had taught it at small events and said, hey, you need to create something bigger. Uh, but certainly beyond that, every single thing we have created has been based on student feedback. So we really do love to get your ideas and your input. That helps us grow and it helps us serve your needs. So that is a great point. So I appreciate that you're bringing that up. Of course. So thank you so much for joining us on Real Talk, Julie. I know it's a little 
weird being in this role versus just yes. the behind the scenes? I'm very much a behind the scenes girl. So, but yeah. thank you for having me. <laughs> Absolutely. And I, I love that you got to share with our audience and that they get to see your face and get to learn a little bit more about you. Um, in our audience tonight, thank you for joining us. And if you have any questions around this, around Julie's role, around what this looks like, or how you can share your ideas with us here at Newborn Care Solutions, or if there's anything you need from us in the office, please put them in the fat, the, put them in the, the, the feed and tag Julie or tag Newborn Care Solutions, and we will make sure that you get answers. And if you're wanting to rewatch this segment or any of our other segments, you can find them on our education tab on our website, or you can go over to YouTube and go and use their little search function. Google has become such a verb, hasn't it? Right. Uh, use their search function and put in Real Talk Newborn Care Solutions and all of them will come up. So thank you for joining us and have a fantastic night.